What's happening everybody? Thank you for coming to another video. It's more motivation. We gotta get our priorities straight. Let me give you guys a scenario. What would you do if you met your favorite celebrity, what would you do? The average person, if there was an opportunity to sleep with them, they would, guy or, guy or girl. If there was an opportunity to take a photo of them, they would. If there was an opportunity to get an Instagram story or something with that celebrity, they would, right? Or someone that stands out do. They try to conversate, they try to pick their brain about certain things about life and try to get information on how they overcame stuff to get to where they're at so that they can apply to their lives and help other people and themselves be the best version of themselves. That's what 3% of people would do. But 97% would do all those other things so that they can go tell their friends, right? so that they can get approval from people that aren't even on their level or people that are average, right? We gotta get our priorities straight. We gotta stop thinking about trying to please people. We gotta stop thinking about trying to be popular and things like that. We gotta think about things along the line of impact, things along the line of making a difference, think along the line of being at service, right? Because most of us would do those three things I said before, but a very few of us will actually try to pick their brain about things that are actually tangible, actually more important in your life. Know what I mean? What people that do not know you think about you isn't important. But getting information to help you, getting information to help your life is far more important. I heard Kevin Hart talking about a story right, on a podcast. I think I think it was a Joe Rogan podcast. He was talking about how he was in the bathroom and there was paparazzis outside of the bathroom. Somebody was in the bathroom when he was he was taking a shit supposedly. And this guy literally stuck around in the bathroom booth next to him until he could get out to take a photo with him. Imagine how awkward that is. You know, you're someone that makes an impact on the world. You're funny. You're someone like Kevin Hart. You're in the bathroom trying to take a shit. And then someone in the other booth sticks around till you're done so they can get a photo. How silly. Like, like guys, think about it. Think about how weird that is. Think about how normal that is, right? But we think that's a normal thing. These people are people also. Just because someone's a celebrity doesn't mean they're not a person. They're a person also. People won't even have conversations with them. People will just stick around to get a photo, then leave. Stick around to get some sort of benefit from the person and leave. Even though this person is giving the most, giving value to the world, doing their own craft. We got to set ourselves apart. We got to be different. Don't be that person. Don't act like a fan. Don't idolize people. You can appreciate it. You can appreciate how far they went, how they impact the world, how they're so talented and so skilled at what to do. You can appreciate that, but you can't let it make you act strange. You can't let it make you put yourself down here, right? Treat them like a person. Treat them like a person. Think about how weird that is. You're in the bathroom trying to take a shit. Someone is in there waiting for you to be done just to take a photo. I'll say at least that. We gotta get our minds straight. What would you do if you met your favorite celebrity? Would you be starstruck or would you just treat them like a person? Would you just try to learn something from them while you are interacting with them instead of trying to 
take something from them to get approval from your friends because of the photo you took with them, for example. We gotta get our minds in a better place, right? There's no difference between us and celebrities. They just committed to something. They just have a skill. They just found it at a good time, stuck with it, won the right places, the right times, didn't give up on it, and eventually, now they're reaping all the benefits. They're reaping all the benefits. I don't get jealous. I will not get starstruck. Why? Because there's no difference between me and these people. The only difference is they found what they're good at and they stuck with it until it became successful. If you listen to every successful person, their first one to five years, they were nobodies. But all of a sudden after that, they started seeing incremental improvement. We're no different. We are no different. We gotta start acting like we're humans also. We gotta start acting like we have value also, right? Stop being starstruck. Stop being so traumatized by another person that is just like you, who happened to work harder than you, and who happened, to, who, who stuck with what they did for the long haul. You know what I mean? So, what would you do if you met your favorite celebrity? What would you do if you met your favorite star? Someone you look up to. What would you do? The answer to this question determines where your priority is. That's all I got today. Thank you for watching the video. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. I'll see you guys next video. Peace.